Well, we still have a freezing drizzle advisory out there, winter weather advisory, and a hard freeze warning also in effect tonight. The weather has been hovering around freezing all day long. Add in a misty drizzle, and we're seeing roads across Central Texas affected. The Austin Fire Department says that they're starting to see bridges and overpass ice all over the city. And in the last 15 minutes, crews reopened in Mopac near Duval after a crash closed the highway there. Within the last hour, Cedar Park closed off toll roads to traffic, telling drivers ice is making it too dangerous. Kex Sands, Aaron Cargill is live tonight at Mopac and Palmer to give us an update. Aaron, what's it look like out there? Well, guys, uh, it is not too bad here in this spot. We are at Mopac and Palmer Lane, but you can see one of these overpasses behind me that you guys were just talking about. I actually saw a TxDOT truck uh, drive over this overpass, putting down some solution, hoping to uh, melt any ice on contact. That's what they're doing right now all over the area. I can also tell you in the last hour and a half, I drove slowly from down in South Austin on Mopac near Ben White all the way here to Mopac. Pack and Palmer. I can't tell you how many uh, crashes that I saw. A lot of emergency vehicles, also a lot of cars uh, with some damage up on those flatbed tow trucks. Now, I also understand that if you go a little farther north here on Palmer Lane, there is a four car collision that crews are working right now due to the ice and so many more stories like that. As you continue heading north to the Cedar Park Leander area, we were trying to get there to show you the scene, but we didn't want to risk it either and get there uh, and have an unsafe safe situation. So uh, once we're done with this live shot and updating you guys on the situation, we are going to head up north and try to give you a better picture of what is happening there. I also want to tell you I've seen some Capital Metro buses drive by. Capital Metro is telling all of their bus drivers to avoid the bridges and overpasses right now because of the icy conditions. The best advice that I can give you is be smart out there and take it slow uh, because you just don't know when you're going to hit that icy patch until it's too late. We'll keep you updated on anything we see, but for now, we're going to send it back to you. All right, Aaron, thanks. We appreciate your coverage. And here's a list of the roads that are closed right now because of icy weather or crashes. The main lanes of northbound Mopac south of Palmer Lane reopened after a crash there, but TxDOT cameras show more backups in the area after what appears to be a wreck in the express lane. We have pictures just in from Austin Travis County EMS. State Highway 71 near Spanish Oaks Club Boulevard and Bee Cave is closed while first responders work a deadly three car crash there. The Cedar Park Police Department is asking drivers to avoid toll roads in the area. 183A from Leander to Cedar Park just reopened, but police are urging drivers to go slowly. Nearby RM 1431 between Vista Ridge Boulevard and MMC Millworks is closed. West Palmer Lane at Dallas Drive also shut down. And